Hi, I'm Brent White, Retail Manager for Pioneer in Middle and East Tennessee. We're standing in a field of 13777 PCE this morning, exciting new product uh, commercially for the first year this year in 2025, doing some stand evaluations in Murfreesboro, Tennessee. 13777 is a direct replacement for 1289, which has been a really, really good wet feet product here in Middle Tennessee. Wide area of adaptability on this thing, uh, fits a lot of acres, something that we can plant on just about any acre in the country. Um, something early that doesn't give up a lot of yield, like a 109, 110-day product. The biggest thing on 13777 that we've seen the last couple years testing it is the fact that it will actually dry down. Even with a fungicide, this thing, when it gets ready, it starts drying, you can get a combine in there and get it out. So stand evaluation here, uh, looks like we've got about 31,000, 32,000 out here. Uh, most of these plants came up extremely evenly. We had a really, really good spring this year with some early warm weather. All right, so uh, looking at stand evaluation here, we've already done some stand counts and uh, got a good idea what we've got there. But looking at uh, the corn plants themselves, counting collard leaves, uh, you've got one, two, and almost three here. So we're at that stage now we need to be planning on uh, thinking about getting nitrogen out here for a side dress application at V5 to V7. Uh, that's the point in time you're going to be establishing rows around. I know we don't think about that a lot of times until we're walking in this, this stuff in the fall, but this is the point in time where these corn plants need to be very, very happy to get the rows around that we want, those 18s, 16, 18s uh, around, and then uh, toward the end of season we'll get determination of how long those ears will be. If you're looking for a corn product that fits a lot of acres in middle and east Tennessee, southern Kentucky, that don't necessarily have to spray with a fungicide but would benefit from one, 13777 is going to fit that wide area of adaptability. That concludes this Pioneer Agronomy video podcast. Visit our page on pioneer.com and follow us on Twitter and Facebook for more agronomy insights.